The next question. My name is Ajmal Saifi. I'm from India, city Polkua. I want to know how to do dawa and where to start. What is the first step of dawa? Do you have any course to learn dawa? Dawa is compulsory upon every single Muslim and being a part-time dai it is compulsory upon every single Muslim. And there are various strategies of conveying the message of Islam. Some are less effective, others are more effective. Majority whenever they meet a non-Muslim, they speak to him a hundred good points about Islam. Even if the non-Muslim he agrees with all the hundred good points that have been spoken, yet at the back of his mind he will have a few negative points. He will say, I do agree with what you have said, but you are the same Muslim who is a terrorist. Ah, you are the same Muslim who is a fundamentalist. You are the people who marry more than one woman. You are the same people who have spread your religion at the point of the sword. These few negative points at the back of his mind will prevent him from accepting the beauty of Islam. That's the reason when I meet a non-Muslim, what I prefer, I ask him up front, what do you feel is wrong with Islam? With the limited knowledge, whether right or wrong, what do you feel is wrong with Islam? And I make him comfortable. And after he's made comfortable, he poses three or four questions. And there are a set of 20 most common questions asked by non-Muslims regarding Islam. Every Muslim should be aware of these 20 most common questions. It is better to know the answers of 20 most common questions rather than knowing the answers of 100 uncommon questions. And if we are aware of the answers of these 20 most common questions, even if the non-Muslim, if he doesn't embrace Islam, at least we can neutralize the animosity that is there in his mind regarding Islam. Besides this, we should talk about the commonalities in the major world religions. As Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the glorious Quran in Surah Ali Imran, chapter number 3, verse number 64. Qul kitab, say O people of the book, ta'alaw ila kalimatin sawa in baynina wa Come to common terms as between us and you. Which is the first term? Allah na'bud illallah. That we worship none but one almighty God. Wala anushika bihi shay'a. That we associate no partners with him. Wala yattakhida ba'aduna ba'adun arbaaban min dunillah. That we erect not among ourselves lords and patrons other than Allah. Fa in tawallaw. If then they turn back. Fa kulu shadu. Say ye bear witness. Bi anna muslimoon. That we are muslims bowing our will to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Thing that we need to do is talk about the commonalities in the major world religions and all the major world religions of the world they talk about monotheism that is the oneness of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala whether it be Hinduism whether it be Christianity whether it be Buddhism all of the major world religions they talk about monotheism that is the oneness of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala so we should talk about the commonalities in the major world religions and besides this there is also a dawah training program that has been conducted and the material is available online on the website www.zakirnaik.com and you can refer to the material it shows the various techniques the tips that are related to dawa how to convey the message of islam regarding question answer sessions regarding debates all of these things they are covered in this dawa training program the material is available online, you can refer to it and inshallah it will help you immensely when you're doing dawah to the non-Muslims, when you're conveying the message of Islam to the non-Muslims. It is very important that you convey the message of Islam to the non-Muslims, to those who are unaware of it.